Today is, is Monday, October 2nd, 2023. My name is Bryson. And I'm Story. Welcome back to JPNN. Today is National Custodial Workers Day. Mr. Neil, Mr. Sean, and Mr. Mark do such an amazing job keeping our building clean and looking amazing. They sure do. We don't always see them doing it because they work before and after school too. But they empty our trash, vacuum our floors, clean our windows and bathrooms, and make our school look beautiful. There, there are also other people in our district like Mr. Eric and Mr. Craig who work super hard to keep everything on our, on our campus working well and looking great. Thank you so much to these hardworking custodians. We appreciate you so much. Hey Bobcats, don't forget this is homecoming week. That's right, I've seen some people dressed like a teacher today. Great job. Tomorrow is pajama day. Everyone gets to wear their, their jammies to school. Wednesday is wear your favorite team jersey day. Any jersey from any sport. Thursday is dressed like Barbie or Ken day. And Friday is, of course, Bobcat Pride Day. Wear your purple Bobcat gear to support our Bobcats. Speaking of Bobcat Pride, we have a special message from Miss Lauren and Miss Silva. Hi, Junior Bobcats. Miss Lauren and I are here to tell you about a really cool new Roars Behavior competition starting today. That's right, Miss Silva. These are Paw Pride tickets. You can earn one when an adult catches you showing amazing Roars Behavior. You could get caught on the bus in the hallway or bathroom, in the cafeteria, in specials, at recess, and in class. When you earn a Paw Pride ticket, you will put it in your grade level jar located in the front office hallway. The grade level that fills their jar first will earn a super top secret amazing prize. Before Christmas, we will dump all the Paw Pride tickets into a school, whole school bucket and see how far we have filled it. If the bucket is filled, you can earn a whole school reward. Only certain adults will have these tickets, so you never know when you're going to get caught being an amazing Roars student. And don't forget, you can still earn your positive office referrals for great Roars behaviors, too. We, we can't wait to, to catch you rocking, rocking those Roars! Woo! Today the dining room is serving burgers, french fries, and fruit, and other food from the salad bar. The weather today is going to be cooler with a high of 63 degrees and a chance of rain in the afternoon. Tuesday looks even cooler with a high of 52 degrees and a good chance of rain in the afternoon. Make sure to wear warmer clothes so you can still play outside at recess. And now a spooky message from Miss G. Hey Junior Bobcats and happy October. This month Miss Maley and I are going to be talking to you about some of our favorite Halloween type books. Some are gonna be scary, some are gonna be silly, and all of them can be found in our library. So the first book I wanna to talk to you about is my favorite super creepy scary chapter book. Now, if you don't like scary books, this is not for you, cause it's scary, but if you like scary books, listen up. This book is called The Screaming Staircase by Jonathan Stroud, and it's about a main character named Lucy. And Lucy lives in England about the same time period as now. There's cars and TVs, but there's something called the problem and the problem is ghosts there's a lot of ghosts in england and they don't know why what's happening um and the really cool part about this book is that the ghost hunters are kids because once you get old enough once you're a grown-up you can't see the ghosts anymore so the grown-ups kind of run the show but the kids are the actual ghost hunters so lucy our main character has a really special talent to hear and see and maybe even talk to ghosts. And she joins um, a group in London to hunt ghosts and it's all about her adventures with these new friends. And um, in this particular book, they get hired to go kind of clean out the ghosts in this really creepy old mansion. Um, and they're specifically looking for a screaming staircase. It's the first in a series, too. So if you love this book, there are four more. It's fabulous. They're great characters. It's super creepy. And if you're interested in it, come check it out at our library. The Screaming Staircase by Jonathan Stroud. Have a great day, friends. Hey, Junior Bobcat. Student Council meets after school today. Robotics, choir, and art club meet on Tuesdays. Garden Club, Bobcat Beats meet on Wednesday. Girls on the Run and Gamers Club meet on Thursdays. We hope you have a marvelous Monday. Don't forget to wear your pajamas tomorrow. I'm Axel. And I'm Natalia.
signing off of JBNN.